you have chosen an event, click the Create button and created a book from that event. Editing that book is easy. Come to the left-hand side of iPhoto and your projects are listed here, including any book that you've created. Click on the book and you'll see a layout of all of the pages as they are currently. I can easily add a page by clicking the Add a Page button in the bottom right-hand corner, change the design of any of the pages by clicking the Design button, choosing the page, and I have options like the background color, the layout of the page. I can even change the number of photos I'd like to be shown on that page. I can also change the photo of that page by clicking on the Photos tab. The photos that have a check mark listed are photos that are already included in my book. The ones with no check mark have not been added to my book. This easily allows you to not have duplicates in a book. I can also easily change the page numbers by simply clicking and dragging the pages around in whatever order I would like them to go. Books allow you to have full spread pictures, landscape pictures. I can even change the theme of my book by pressing the Change Theme button. My book browser will load and I can get a preview of how my book would look in a different theme. If I like the different theme better, I can click Apply and my entire book will be changed to that new theme. If I hit Cancel, it will take me back to the original theme I have already chosen. I can also choose to start over by clicking Clear Placed Photos. I still have the ability to see all of the pictures I've chosen, but now I can put them in whatever order I would like. Simply clicking Buy Book will link to your iTunes account and allow you to purchase your book.